having those who work as a team. A team? After being trained separately. <gasps> Finally. I mean, that's a good idea. <laughs> team building, yes. Teamwork, team building, team stuff. Team. Let me go see what X has been doing. By the way, uh... There's a possible chance that X will lose control of himself. Wait a minute, who? Who? X, the demon hunter that Elijah paid. I was like, who the f*** is that? But, oh, thanks, yeah. Yeah, cause, cause, <laughs> cause that's... What? Why you... Huh? Well, whatever, that's cool, um... Thanks. He has a demon in him that named the Jebediah. Sounds horrible. And that is why... He is here and not in the Badlands still. Cause he actually killed some warlords. Oh darn. That was not the idea we were wanting. Wait, were they at least on their side? No, it was on our side. Fuck. Oh, you're here. You know Gerald? One of them was an orange dragon that was killed as well. Gerald. No. I don't know, he looks like a giant ultramarine, but whatever. Okay, giant dude yes, in armor? Yes, I met him once. He's I, making your item. Met him once, yes. It should be done tomorrow. Oh. Great, thank you. Yeah, just don't lose it, considering it might, like, be bad if it gets into the wrong hands I, and I, stuff. I, I won't lose it. Because yeah, the last guy lost it, and it's on the black... last guy lost this other magic item, it's on the black market. So I'm trying to get that back, but... Eh, whatever. I'll get it later. Well, at the very least, if I if I lose it, it'll be in another world, and it probably won't be your problem. Hopefully. Yes, it yes it will be. I won't lose it though. It'll, I won't lose it. It'll it'll be my problem. But anyways, I won't lose it. It's going to be specially coded to uh to to only psychic types, so only they can use it. And if anyone else tries to, to use what? it, to, to to psychic people, it's going to be like a two. Coded to what? At okay, better word, attuned. Okay, sorry, no, I I blanked out, didn't hear you for a sec, sorry. Yeah, um, I'm going to have it, like, attuned to, like, only psychic types. So if non-psychics use it, or touch it, they'll get a splitting headache. I, I couldn't really think that's of totally something damaged. else, that's, it's funny. Not really damage, it's like... Damn, yeah, just mild discomfort. <laughs> No, not mild. Like, a lot this Not mild? Perfect. But no damage. I see, I see. Okay. But, whatever. Thanks, God. Also, even your, uh... What is it? Your significant other can use it. Perfect. She's got some plans. Either he's not inside anymore, or he's hiding his presence. He's here? Oh, boy. He was. Yes, X. Okay. Go around. Other, he's hidden his presence enough to where I can't find him. We kind of need him for the training. Oh, well. well uh, I'm we sure before uh, then, we could have a strategy meeting. I'm sure he'll turn up when he's needed. Mm -hmm. Or whatever. Um, this is how unstable he is with a Jebediah. It's a really good idea for him to be training us then? Hmm. Probably not. Well, let's just say I have a plan, and it does require us to go to the old training grounds. Okay. There, there's a ley line there that's a lot closer than it was when I first tried the attempt to steal Jebediah. Let's see. They I think we might be able to do something about him. Mm-hmm. Ah, oh, there he is. So, this Jebediah or, or uh, Demon Hunter or whatever, I, I don't know. Um, is this going to be everyone? Like, one, one, two, three, four, five? Yes. I don't know. No one else has asked where I've been. Where's Kane? Where'd Kane go? I saw him go up there. He went inside, probably, to try and find him. 
Don't study out here and getting you any closer. <laughs> Son of a Fuck. gun. Ugh. <laughs> <sighs> Wasn't having a conversation. It was an overall term, but okay. We gotta take an ERP. See how it is. Cause we're just going up the giant castle okay. thing now. Find him. Yeah. He's yeah. up on the roof. Oh jeez. Oh roofs and shit. I right, guess we're going tall. I want to go up on the roof. Hmm. Wait a second. Well, there was the plan of training Zack and Ken. Wonderful. Are okay, you something that you were the one that came up with. Oh, well, this is oh, a, yes. a thing. Oh, yes. Oh, it's... Oh. I, don't know how, I didn't know how many gathering up here. I mean, you're the one that was up here first. Oh yes, it's just the view is very peaceful. <laughs> Either way, let's get on down. Mm. I suppose, I suppose. <sighs> it's jumping. Hmm? Jumping. <laughs> I don't really much care for it. Ah, uh, great. Okay. You know, you don't have to... Uh, did you see, like, a wind swirl around me? Uh, some stupid ass. The soldiers jumped down! I'm a cat. Bye. I didn't want to tell him before I say anything. Oh gosh. You'll see that where Lucian landed is just just a rather giant crater. Oh. Thank you for those clothes, by the way. Geez, it's probably slow the impact a bit more. Pretty hardcore. I mean, it did jump up pretty high, or I did at least. I mean, you don't have to jump directly down. I mean, that's yeah, whatever. It's pretty easy up until that last quickest layer. Way. It's the quickest way down. True. Either way, let us go to the other terrain ground and begin this. Okay. You'll see him open up a portal. Oh no. <gasps> We're here. Yay. All right. Oh, here comes uh, the again. Fucking. <laughs> They, they need those. Uh, 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 I just got that shit on the way. Back, let's go over here. Alright. <laughs> I will advise you might want to go all out. Okay. Wait, where's everyone else going? Oh, I, I guess they're back there or whatever. 
I want to see what you guys are all about. I didn't say I was going to fight. You'll see Lucian, uh, remember Lucian do his runes like he did before for mm. the DK defense? Runes? <gasps> he uses his magic sense. <gasps> Zach's going to pull out two daggers. You will see him pull out the pocket space, his large knife. Are you fucking uh, kidding it me? would oh, be a bit that. taller than you. I'm just gonna stop you right here. What the hell is this? Oh, I can generate imitation dragon scales over my body. Yeah, but why are you using it now? Cause he's I gonna fucking go kill out. me. <laughs> Trust me, he can easily kick my ass when I'm using this. So does this form have a duration, or is it does it take your stamina? Uh, it takes a little bit of my mana to form, but other than that, it's just a form. I need to regenerate it if it gets broken with more mana, but seeing as we're going to Dragon World, it's going to get broken a lot. That is a problem, so keep in mind. Besides that, I can't... You have to I use can't mana. use its full strength without expending mana. Yes, it does take mana, doesn't it? And that is, and that's a continuous drain. Uh, You'll see him pull seems out. Seems like a fourteen uh, hundreds gun. More of a downside than an upside well. now, but it is defense, so yeah, keep that in mind. Plus, it helps my strength actually and speed. Strength and speed. Yeah, we'll just test this out first. Actually, this what might hurt a bit. All this uh, different he pulled out the archivist. Nonsense. The Boy, old fourteen hundreds gun. What? Okay. Oh, let's see now. Hmm. Well, I guess we should begin. He'll pull it up, and you'll see him pull the trigger. Cata, you'll notice that mana is just a large amount of mana is being poured into this. Hmm. And as it fires, he's actually holding back enough to where it will just damage his armor. Is that gonna put up both of his daggers and like dodge to the side? <laughs> and just. Okay then! <laughs> he's just gonna rush in and just. Go for a stab. Uh, Alright. As you're coming in, he will toss the gun aside for the time being. Then come up with the arm that just tossed it to deflect your arm up. He will then go with the scythe to use the staff part of it to just push you away. You'll see him take a low step with the scythe behind him. His we'll knife is going to extend into a spear. I will have to say, or at least doing better on the offensive. Right. And he's going to come in with a slash of the spear. Mm hmm. He's going to swing around the scythe after pulling it towards him to so he has more of the length of it behind him uh, so that when you get close enough the, the head of the scythe which is unbladed is going to come at your gut as he ducks under the spear he's going to twist the dagger and put it up to block and set the spear behind him to steady himself. Uh, you would get pushed back about only like 10 feet. Since you are holding yourself in place as well. Alright. Now, let's see how well your defense still is. Hey, Kata. What's up? Oh, yeah, you, 
<laughs> what you're gonna do is you're gonna turn your head around slightly and just notice the fact that Kane's on the ground and he's being basically choked. Like, I'm gonna kill him patent pretty much at this point. <laughs> well, I do have my magic sensor. Hmm. I'm gonna rush forward. Killing. But before he even gets, I get the gas back there so I can RP strike. this. Um, I'll be back. I know there's some crazy shit going on here. Hey, stranger. Go on. I think you're, uh, hey. I think he's had enough. He wouldn't, at that point, he wouldn't actually really, he, he, he wouldn't even shut it. He'd just, he'd just carry on just, like, applying force down on his neck. You see him reach into my bag and it just starts shooting like three stones at your head going about 30 miles per hour. But they're not going to break skin or break a bone. They're probably going to clank against his helmet. <laughs> That's the plan. It'll probably clank against his helmet. It'll bob his head up and he's like, if you're looking direct and they hit from his thigh, it'd have like a bit of a torn like wounding to him like straight to, straight and completely straight eventually after that he'd, he'd just he'd lift he'd, he'd release the pressure and just sort of like back up a little bit hey kane oh jeez what is going on here you do realize sparring doesn't involve like Killing each other, right? Save that for the enemy. What? What's going Can on? Can we bring our weapons in? Huh? What? Can we agree no weapons then? Yeah. Uh. Uh, what's going on? Uh, I saw her in the... I, I don't know. I ate the salmon. Salmon's mine. What do you mean? <laughs> uh, she had food anyways. It was weird. She she came home with a bunch of food. She like like a bag and stuff. Like, his, his, his head would just be just a crack. Okay. <laughs> I thought I had to monitor the other guys more. Uh, got like a human over there, a demon. <laughs> So beaten up. <laughs> Stop poking towards the wound itself. Just like stepping in, like you know, facing to the inside of it all. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> Oh, so what is it today? What's the day then? Is it, uh, what was it, training day? It was training day. I love training day. Mm -hmm. Oh, who's that one? I like him. His face Me? is like, meow. He looks like a, a very nice individual, I'll be honest. <laughs> Which one is he? Well... Stop like limping over towards Ken. X. Which one? Hmm? Which one is he? Which one is he? Huh? Huh? Who is he? Tell, explain, talk to me. I just already know who his name is. Do I? Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, let me let me guess. Let me guess. Let me guess. Shiny. I'm shiny, I'm going to want shiny. Hi, shiny! Hello, shiny! It's a shiny. It's a shiny. It's a shiny. 
Yes, wave, yes. Yes, you like to wave, don't you? <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh. Oh. That wasn't very nice of me, honest. Okay. Okay. I'll, I'll ask him nicely not to do that again, okay? If you, if you do that again, okay? We did agree yeah, upon a weapon. Okay, okay, that's that's fine, that's fine. I didn't use okay, a weapon. Well, that's absolutely fine. If there's any weapons of fault, we're going to... Uh, we're gonna... I'm um, gonna, gonna have to find the most largest thing possible. And beat you with it. Okay? And that's probably gonna be a rock. Alright then. There's a rock, there's a rock, there's a rock count as a weapon. There's a count as a weapon. It counts as wildlife. No, it doesn't count as a weapon. Wildlife, okay? It's like getting a butterfly and flapping the wings in your face and seeing if that works, okay? So, what you're going to do, okay, is that you're going to go and uh, punch me, punch me! In the face. Properly in the face. Okay? Mm. Right into the metalac. Metalac. Met 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 Remember that metalac. 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 Okay, punch directly towards the metalac. He'll try to, he'll see his arm pull up and start to try to hit you in the face. Or that happens, he'll probably just smack towards the actual, like, the, the helmet piece itself. Yeah. And he'll, bang, bang. Good one! <laughs> oh. <laughs> you can hmm. punch, I like punching, do you like punching? Come here, come here, come here, um... come here. It's all right. He's not trying I'm here. I'm not. He's not trying to do He's trying to like not, help you guys train, train, but not physically. He's the no. ref. Do you not train? He's the ref. Are you the ref? Yes. Yeah, I'm the ref now. Ah oh, shit! Wonderful, 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 wonderful. Okay, right. Let's 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 go that way. Okay, we're gonna go towards the water. Okay. Okay. It would start like sort of like patting yeah. you on the chest and just like. Trying to push you in that general direction. Come on, water boy, water, water. Are we gonna train or are we just like? We're gonna tr we're gonna train. Trust me, trust me. We're gonna train. Okay, water. It's like pushing you, edging that way. Come on, to the water, to the water, to the water, to the water. Uh, what's going on? Yes, to the water. Okay, you see the water. You see it. You see the water. Okay. So what you have to do is that you have to one. Climb into the water and then bury your head under it. Okay. Um. Most people would waterboard your opponent. Okay. Do you know what waterboarding yeah, is, referee? Left leg. Yeah, I, I do. That well, doesn't sound like a good thing. And uh, okay. back here, knee, just trying to throw you off your balance and make you fall forward. It probably, it'll probably happen actually. He'll just like fall back. He'll, he'll probably just fall backwards. He'll just fall down onto his uh, onto his ass rather. Just like <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to teach you here, son. I'll Do be back. Not interfere in a fight. I mean, not fight, not really a fight. But if you can call that fight, you can call that fight. Let's call that fight. You'd start pushing yourself up. It's supposed to be training, to not around. training, not We're not trying to fight. About it, we're talking about it. We're going to explain. We're going to explain. If you don't explain, you just don't. Oh my! Oh, X! I know you are such a pain in the backside. I know. I swear to God, if you keep on doing this, I'm going to hit. I'll, I'll punch you. I'll do it. No, man, you don't want to do that. You know. <sighs> So is it gonna still stab you, or? You guys uh, always over here. Let's see. Actually, we went a bit far. Yeah, due to the since this is a large size, I think it would, since and it's taller than oh. you, I think the spear is shorter. I see. He's just making it to where he deflects it enough so it's off target, but he's also following along it so he can hit against the joint. So it'd be going kind of upwards over your shoulders at that point. It'd be, uh, basically, mana starts to basically just like form up and so sort of like uh, uh, like a flow almost. 
uh, <laughs> at that point, he would um, like Arcane basically start to like appear from there as well, and he would just Kane completely be just... able to see the glow in any way. Yes, I can yes. see the glow. He would start to because he would know what you're probably trying to do. Uh. He, he's gonna count. He's gonna count on just basically he's gonna charge directly towards the temples themselves. At that point, mm -hmm. still. So yeah, you know, the, the, basically the manor itself basically starts to you know flare up almost. It was completely just like start his charge over towards him, and uh, as I say, the arcane and basically started to emerge and like you know trickling across his arms, his arm, and so. Um, mm -hmm. But he'll, he'd instantly just he'd go over, and he'd attempt to grab onto the your left tentacle, mm -hmm. and Angel just basically just pull it away. Forcefully to start to pull it away. And while pu while attempting to auto pull it away, after strictly after mm -hmm. that, he would attempt to even just just ex attempt to just basically just throw out a simple punch directly towards the center of the chest itself. If you grab at the center the left tentacle, the tentacle would actually wrap around that hand and basically hold it out and while you try to punch him, the right tentacle would basically wrap around that arm and essentially just hold your arm outward. Is he gonna drop into a slide down this hill? Hey, he, like I halfway don't. up the hill. Okay, so uh, he is going to go hey. for a stab at your abdomen. With my knife? Yeah, I think your demon hunter not friend not is, is um a bit unstable. Yeah. Just um <laughs> why Elijah put him in timeout. He's gonna come in with his arm and did like are gonna him out of his world. Out of it. Like like he's fighting. But they're not gonna actually mm -hmm. remember yeah. launch. He's just gonna try and doesn't want to impale you as he tries to deflect mm -hmm. the knife with his other hand. Mm hmm He's going to tilt his head to the side and bite Fortunately, you down I don't off, think Elijah would know how to get here. No to way. essentially make it to where you're moving him down here I mean, I could as you're gliding still. BS my way to getting in and here, we get but us, don't know if I want to do that. going to come up behind you. Mm -hmm. I see. Uh, he is going to... So well, I'm going to make sure they're not uh, killing each other again. Portal the both of us. <laughs> you know what, screw it, I'll just yeah, bring Elijah here. I'll us. Out. Technically he has a tracker on Kane, somewhat. Oh my. Blood. Did I just see something? What the fuck did they go with? <laughs> yes. Oh my! Oh, I haven't touched the water yet. That's inside. Oh god! I didn't even know this place was <laughs> over here. Radar. But no. Perfect. He's gonna yeah, let go and quickly push off of your stomach. While also bringing other his other foot to your left arm to kind of distract you while he's pushing away to try to get away. All right, he's gonna let you kick off, but black tendrils are gonna wrap around the knife so that you're forced to let go of it. Oh yeah, he would have let go anyways, because he doesn't want to hold down anymore. He can't hold on to it for too long. You're gonna see the, sh the scales on him like shift and great, but they settle down with his hands with the knife. All right, <laughs> we'll change up the scenery once in a while. Yeah, I can see that. <clears throat> He's gonna. Sh Raise his palm and fire a bolt of magical energy at you. <laughs> Alright. He's just gonna duck under it. He's gonna rush in. And he's just gonna he's gonna he looks like he's going for like a splash, but then he's just gonna raise his arm his leg and just kick you <laughs> right into that log. Alright. So as you're rushing in Do something 
important and maybe you could fight it and we'll fight it together and maybe we can do something about it. What are you going to do? He would start to look at the, the crossbow bolt closely and the water as he still trying to keep an eye on you. At that point, he would actually start pulling out his crossbow and actually just... Not the sword, not mm -hmm. the sword. But he would draw, draw the crossbow out itself. And immediate, immediate at that point, uh, an arcanic structure would be, like, an arcanic structure of the arrow would start to appear on it. Mm -hmm. So, did you know that? Also, if you if, <laughs> also if you didn't know, it's like if you keep on firing at the arrow, just already go for the arrow itself. Okay, if you don't go for the arrow itself, you have no idea what the hell you could do for you. You know, just go for the arrow. You touch the arrow. You touch the arrow, you win the fight. Maybe I don't know. Actually, no, that's just that's the weird concept of winning, isn't it? Like, maybe, maybe. He would be, he would be, while staring at you, his right tentacle will look, thresh out and try to grab at the arrow in the water. Mm -hmm. As soon as it is, it try would directly to. just, it would instantly just start pointing it directly towards the features of where Cain stands, and it would just instantly just shout, HALT! If you go for it, you can be killed. Mm -hmm. But that's where you have to make your, your choice. Do you go for it? Or do you just die? You have no idea. You would say, um, basically dive into the water and try to grab at the, the crossbow bolt. It would instantly, he would instantly just pull the trigger directly on the crossbow itself, aiming towards, mm -hmm. well, as you go to, straight towards, he would just aim it directly towards, practically the torso of Kane. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I block it with a water shield. Hmm. What is that thing? It'll probably hit then hit. Yeah, we're. In which? Oh, we see? Oh, in character. Sorry. In character. Okay. <laughs> oh, yeah. It'll, 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 it'll probably just hit against the water shield as, as a. As it a blocks for. Itself. It's, it's, it's designed to block projectiles. So, yes. Okay, it's practically what it is. It's just an arcanic shot. Uh, of course, just simple magic bolts. So, yeah, if I at it, it'll probably just, like, you know, get stuck into it. Probably, like, delve slightly towards it, and then suddenly just, like, psh. Yep. At that point, it'll just, like, lower it. <laughs> hey, uh... <laughs> this is, a. Uh... As I reminded you, you're supposed to be training, not killing each other. We need to save that for the enemy. Oh, but that's not fun enough. Fun? It's... Oh, we I need see. to inter get it. Oopsie. <laughs> need to get the fun going. Going. But now you're just, just sort of holster the, the crossbow itself. Ah, <sighs> we need to be able to kill. It's a kill or be killed scenario. If you that do not true. fight till you're dead. But this scenario. Try and kill you. This scenario is not kill or to be killed. It's just trying to train to make each other stronger. Understand. That's the, that's the idea, though. The how they get stronger is to basically fight them until they're practically dead. That's how it works. <laughs> um, 
That's why you have to watch it. You have to watch it. Do you mind if we have act back? Mm, nah, I, I kind of do. I I kind of do enjoy. You know, it's he he does he doesn't he doesn't need to you know he doesn't need to really you know jump into this guy. To like, I'm checking yeah, on the others. Really, pretty much. Oh, yeah. wonderful. Jeez. Start to sort of like wander over closely and just like wave his arms around. Hello. You don't hey really need his. Yeah. Oh, uh... To be honest. Yeah. You just don't. You uh, okay. do know this is being a tad bit extreme. Try to shoot one of his yeah, like magical bolts. Okay. Okay. Coming soon. Just... <sighs> trying to find the others. I'm going back to the swamp. <laughs> oh, that's not it. Here. Oh, I see them. So, you're going to see the spear come flying in behind you. He's going to deflect mm -hmm. with this arm, throw forward his dagger, so that you're basically impaling yourself, which, mm -hmm. hold on, i got to roll to see if he can do. <laughs> no, the dagger just kind of falls down, but he's still also going to just punch you in the gut as hard as he can as the mm -hmm. spear comes behind you. Uh, now let me process all this. Okay. Um... <laughs> Just randomly your cat out of there. Yep. You know, um, so he's gonna take the punch, but he's going to grab on your arm and using the momentum he had to swing you around in the way of the spear. Alright, well it's being controlled by his mind, so it just kind of Yeah. Well this is the hand Problem you grab is... and this is the punch. Oh yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm grabbing the back. punch. Oh, the punch? Yes. Ah. Because so that he's makes more sense the... to take the punch. Yeah. So he's going to grab the spear as you swing him around by, like, deflecting it so it has most of its momentum still, since it can't stop it mm -hmm. fully. And he's just going to go to stab you with it as it returns to dagger form. Ooh. Uh, that's going to hit him. Oh. He is going to, however, send mana through it and feed back the, uh, one of the effects on it to send electricity through your body. I hate you so much. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta make sure people can't use the weapons against them. He just starts, like, he, he lets go of the, the knife, and kind of falls back as much as he can with you holding his fist. Yeah, he's gonna let you go when you're falling back. Is the knife still in you? <laughs> oh yeah, the knife is still gonna be in him at the moment. But he's gonna grab it and pull it out. Well, managed yeah, to get a rib on that one. Mm. Thank you. You broke my foot. Oh. <laughs> well sprained it. I mean, breaking a rib is a little bit worse, considering not careful can get the rib, uh, lung. I'm sorry. And... You wanna continue? I'm gonna have to no. for now. No continuing yeah. on these injuries. Gather around for some healing. I'm gonna cut call it for now, cause I can't... Okay. Hold it. You won't need to heal me. <laughs> He'll toss a dagger to your feet. Jeez. You'll see him pull out the... Gold orb, and he'll come out over here and just sit and just put it to his lip. You and your just... golden orbs. Ah. 
Oh, just... you'll hear, hear a rather loud crack <sighs> as his rib is going back into place. See the green aura surround your body. Start slowly healing your break. And any sort of cuts and bruises you have, slightly. Now time for the D100. <laughs> So, hold the goal over way. Let's just say okay. you managed to make me get to the point where I would almost pass out. Is that good? 52. <sighs> yes. Woo. I forgot my shield today, so otherwise I would have brought that too. Shield. <laughs> well, you're all good now. Uh, thank you. You still need a day of recovery. Ah. Shield. I'll take it easy on my foot. I got <sighs> shield. It's really nice. I love it. It's a very nice shield. Uh, it's created I by... I just kind of... Oh. Simple? Uh, not continue. Oh yeah, it was created by a member of Aegis, of course. Technology based though. Uh. Hear me clanging. Uh, so was mine. Well, not an Aegis member, but... My girlfriend's pretty handy with tech and materials. Dragon scales. Seem to be quite a few of those lying around lately. Dragon scales. Hmm. I suppose. Yeah, it's not easy to use these ones either. They just keep disintegrating. Why is that? <sighs> uh, because they're from those... K dragons like Elijah. Yes. Mm -hmm. Hmm. And it hurts still quite a bit. So you hold on to that thing. No, you're fine. I think I need to do a few more changes. But yes, they cause a natural sort of decay in the ring due to their exactly. connection with a higher being. Yes. Higher. So their scales naturally wither away as well when they fall off. Makes them hard to work with, but if you can get enough of them. Doesn't seem to be uh, very useful, in my opinion. Oh, it's very useful, well, actually. I mean, once you forge them, they don't do fall apart, and they're kind of restored. They start withering I mean, away what they touch. Oh, so it would be probably a good idea to have something like kind of like what I have. Just kind of like, just stays yes. on, you know? Sure, it'll be easier if you have a method to take it on and off rather easier. I mean, yeah, an like, Aegis are kind like of working my knife, on it. My knife here is uh, actually made from it. So it kind of, it slowly withers and decays what it touches. Yes. It was very useful for um, oh, surgery. Nice. Yeah, surgery. Oh, as a I weapon, so. it seems to be very effective, but armor... And not so much yeah. until you said forge it, right? Of a, think it more of a... Uh, you touch it, you get hurt. Not every day. I mean, touch. that is... Actually, I haven't considered that. Yeah, if someone were to try and strike my shield with a weapon, their weapon would slowly start to break. Mm. Yes, it's kind of like That's rust dragons good. as well. Hmm. You've ever rust heard of dragons those. and rust monsters, all those... Well, no, not rust dragons things. are more... They have a decay kind of a thing, except it only works on metal. Quite annoying to fight. I didn't even Pull consider the decay properties. Put it back in the pocket face. I was just considering uh, the hardness of dragon scales. <laughs> yes. If you open your mind to think outside the box, there's many uses for it. Okay. So you have the that decay... That seems to be my problem lately. Do you have the decay scales or ability? I don't use it that often. But I do, if I really wanted to. Can you try it on my sword? Are you sure? I'm sure. I... I'm highly suggestive against this. Uh, is, you see his hand turned bright green? I would like a neon suggest green. against it as well. Actually, Actually, my I decay well. slowly withers. His Mine. are on a whole other level. Perhaps. 
Just try it. He touches it. What does it do? Or do you want me to roll for it? Absolutely nothing. Hmm. That's intriguing. <clears throat> That's good. Made of a anti decay material. Very interesting. I guess you do hear about those magical weapons that can only be destroyed by, like, primordial flames or something. Yes. Mm. Well, it's more complicated uh, like than that. Like the amulet I have. I imagine so. It always is. You but... see, everything has its strength and weakness, and sometimes things also can be unaffected by various properties. See, my sword is made from a substance called star metal. When it was refined and worked, mm. it's completely immune to corrosion and decay, as well as mm. uh, any sort corrosion of Corrosion, in a way, would fall under decay because of how it works with metal. Exactly. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah, it can't be, metal. Yeah, it can't be rusted or... It's similar to adamantine, if you actually mm. part of it. But this has yeah. its own special properties to deal with of beings that are not from the material plane. Oh, wonderful. Mm. So if I were to cut, say, Lucian here with it, it'll bypass oh, any you. and all of his defenses. Damn. That's why I try not to uh, use this haphazardly on people. Yeah, that's very scary. So, the can it cut souls? Me... No. Just okay. physical. The orb I got from Elijah allows me to do something similar on making them no longer resistant to certain elements. Not unless damage. I do this. <laughs> hmm. Alright, I'm the weakest here. We get it. <laughs> it's not about being <laughs> really strong. You were it's in... about using your... Keep yourself on par with me at full strength. Uh, what? Full strength without using magic. Right, you're a spellcaster. <laughs> I'll take and it melee for now. You're a spellblade or some sort. Well, luckily so, for you, that's the, mage. That's the word. Our first couple missions will not be attacking enemy warlords. Build up our ally mm. front. Me and Sol had talked about missions, possible missions that we could do. Uh, your two options that we boiled it down to are going to Bronzevin to talk to a person that I know is a guaranteed ally, or go further and go to a place called Winter Run. Talk mm -hmm. to another, maybe an ally, maybe not. Maybe an ally. Wonderful. But I could learn magic in Winter Run. There's magical ley lines there. Hmm. They're very close to the city. But if you want weapons, you go to Bronzeman. A lot of master blacksmiths live there. I've been meaning to learn more magic. You're not going to learn magic. Problem. Yeah. A lot of sorcerers and scholars live in Winterrun. I don't know. The problem with going to Winterrun is you'll probably have to fight more monsters. But unfortunately for you, you don't have enough money to buy an airship. And I technically can't go with you, so I have to go on an airship. Speaking of, how much do an airship cost? Us? Five hundred thousand platinum. Yeah, we aren't reaching that anytime soon. I have a question, actually, about the platinum you gave me. Mm -hmm. Yeah, is there a way we could maybe forge it into pure platinum coins? <laughs> I mean, it's not more of a forging, there's a reason why the knitting all is in there. For it makes also... it really difficult to remelt it. Uh, yes. I see. And it's also for the economy. You can't have everybody mm -hmm. having, every city having complete platinum, that'd just be horrible. So how good but your I can't have that you gave me. You need to work on it. 
I'll work on it, but how? I just wanted to know how useful the bag of 80% you gave me is. Very useful, actually. Wonderful. Probably buy a lot of things there. Not everything mm. has to be 100. Gold is still is used. I mean, <laughs> copper, yes. actually copper really barely used. So if copper would probably keep a bag of bread. Bread's nice. 100. Speaking probably... of. He will pull out of the pocket of space a large bag of jerky like he did before and hand it to you. Do you just unload your jerky on me? Just any excess jerky you have? <laughs> uh, I would be careful. Some of those are from the Badlands. Yeah. yeah Badlands jerky? Are you telling me I might be able to... You might as like... well get used to the food now. Right, wait, uh, hold on. Are you telling me that some of these monsters meat right here is Badlands? Yes. Are you telling me that I might be able to eat some of this with my arm? So I don't know if you're going to get uh, out of it. <laughs> yeah, you might I not get anything it. out of it. Possibly. Especially with the process of burning the jerky. Kind of probably makes it kind of useless for... Probably countries. useless for I... countries. I'd just eat it yourself. Get used to the taste. Fair enough. I just realized something. I forgot a power I had. What's that? I can breathe underwater. No, yes, you can breathe underwater. Um, cool. Huh. I haven't got that spell I yet. I just, I, I just, I forgot. I can't see how that would work. I mean, you he did kill a aquatic sentient creature. Um, you can't trick a fish person. Fucking hell. And the sentient. And when I say sentient, I don't mean all level, but sentient enough have their own language. I don't think I want to know what it was, man. Uh, I don't. Like a yeah, it's like a lightning strike. Jellyfish or something. It was weird. <laughs> oh. No, it was more of Oh, those things. Oh, those things. Yeah. yeah. They're around. Yeah. Like a, I, just, I haven't had to go underwater yet, so I forgot about it. I mean, the beaches aren't the safest place in the world. Most people I mean, stay away from the beaches. You can use the waterfall. <laughs> True. The water, okay. This is not something to... <laughs> you can breathe underwater. Noted. I can't swim oh, up waterfalls. <laughs> uh, you can climb them. Not with that attitude. <laughs> I, I Fair, I guess. That's a mess. How's X doing <laughs> in the chain? Yeah, they're probably, oh, he's insane um, as fuck. Yeah, they're probably killing I'm, each other right now. That's the reason why I'm here. I was I gonna get him out of was... timeout. Oh, uh... But he's still I, in timeout. I, There's a I'm reason the why I brought him here in the process. Let's just say X is in, more insane than I am, and I just did something very dark in your guy. So I heard. But Jebediah yeah. I heard about as well. No, something yesterday. And they... I heard about him killing see some of our allies. What did yeah, you know? I know. That's why I was wanting to do a scene, because I would have had to gone to you in the first place. Well, he came because he, had, he sensed that Kane was in danger. What'd you do? Well, what happened last night? Um, I went to the capital, which is an enemy right. territory. <laughs> oh, Kane transformed. Um, oh, that That's thing. All right. Um, Technically, we don't own the capital anymore, so but the, I got so away I heard. with it by saying publicly that I was going to go on the news. So, and invited Flemeth publicly. Hmm. But I'm beginning to see where this is going. Tell Let's the continue. former student... Uh, Kata, would you cover your ears for a second? Uh, what? <laughs> What's going on? It's probably best... Yes. Tell the former student hostage and threatened to... I sent Flemeth a message saying that if she didn't show up, I would kill a former student of mine who's actually an enemy of ours now. And I didn't think I've heard of him. Sent, sent her something that pissed her off, that I'm guaranteeing that would piss her off. Something that my brother was working on. Something called the King of Mandis. Oh, that's a pe peachy name. What he is pretty much. See, why, considering what she tries to call herself. So here's what Zalmot can do. I kind of just went in the woods or now something. Now that I have... So, now that I have my brother's version of Zalmot, she was split into two. Psychoticness mm -hmm. and emotion. 
And you did something like... stupid to fuse them both into your own. Exactly. Whoa, I did do I... that. There was a ritual. He takes off his breastplate and you see a whole bunch of ruins on it. Oh my it's God. into his skin. <laughs> to do that, I needed to get close spiritually and physically to her, to Zalmon. Which, he pulls <sighs> out a sword that is like a, kind of like a short sword that's glowing green. Well, I'm pretty sure I, I can did. sense that. You, you could sense a crap ton of decay on it. Decay magic. This is gonna be like this. Yes. You do I realize this. I stopped it into myself, years, killing right? myself. Oh my god. Mm -hmm. Okay. Doing so didn't really die because it doesn't work on me. But it was a gesture of sacrifice. So I'm pretty much fused with Razor. So I'm technically not the Elijah that you know. I am and still Kara Elijah. as well. No, I can't fuse with Kara, unfortunately. Hmm. Uh, uh, Luna can. It's more of the two males can become one, not. Okay, that's good. So that's technically, I can. Yes. You can uncut your ears, Santa. Realize he has four of them, right? No, Ned. I did not know he had four. Nah, it doesn't work like that. But anyways. <laughs> so, pretty much, I sacrificed, technically, kind of my life was reborn, somewhat, uh, if you think of it, in a way. In a gesture of rebirth. And I sacrificed some of my memories, of my past, that were, you lose memories when you combine them. And you gain memories, but you lose some. Okay. Standing on the rock. So you gained some of Razor's. Yes, but lost some of mine. Alright, so... Now you're a mixture of the asshole we like and the asshole we hate. Exactly. Are you... St you're not gonna try to kill us all, right? Like he did, or...? No. Okay, good. <laughs> He went mad because he was so focused on that power. Oh, right. The psychoticness. Right. He only had that. Yes. Mm -hmm. He went mad because he couldn't obtain it because the person he wanted to kill was not the person that would give him that power. See, if he killed Kara, he wouldn't get that power and become a king. King of Mammoth's power. He had to kill me, and he never thought of me as the person he needed to kill. Right. He just tried to control you. Exactly. So, what I told Flemeth was that she technically fucked up her master's plans that he had. Right to her face. But it really wasn't her, though. How I can tell it was the same one that attacked me a day before. A shadow projection of her. Straight to my house and attacked me. I snapped its neck. It turned to dust. Actually, technically, it was wisps of smoke. Whatever. Okay. <laughs> Alright. So... One of, like, astral projection or some shit. Yes. Technically, Flemeth has created a monster, which is what I am. Some people's eyes, I'm technically a monster now. Eh, people are weird. That's what I've just yes. learned to live with. It's just gonna piss Luna off a lot. But... Oh yeah, it is. She did leave her brother grieving by himself, by himself, wanting power, and it was emotion. I was emotional, so that's kind of her fault. She Sorry, I wasn't there. It's understandable. I mean, it didn't exactly help that you would never get out of your room in the first place when you were first. And room. then you were stuck in the Badlands. I can't really get there. Yes. Well, you got what you deserved. Did you Did you see the video of what happened to him? No, I didn't. <sighs> He shows you a video of him getting a swirly. Of Lucian getting a swirly. <laughs> By a dragon that you've never seen before. Yeah, I love that video. Whole 30 minutes of you getting your ass kicked. Even though you didn't really try. There's countless stupid torture things that happen to you. There's something kept getting up. Yeah, you should've just stayed down and none of this would've happened. No, I had that video of him getting thing. his bloody face thrown through a towel rung. 
No, it was grinded on Tower Rum. Grinded through a Tower Rum. Ouch. What will happen to you? Oh yeah, plants. He filled up... My friend Orion literally filled up water, plants... Of his plants full of water and then dumped it on his head. Yeah, it was kind of weird how methodical he was being, but like it made no sense at the same time. He also tried to stab you with a pitchfork and then tried to chop a tree down on you. And then tried to grab the drag the tree through his house, and then the tree fell, and then pretty much what ended up happening is his wife hates it, Lucia now. Because we blamed it on Lucia. The house being destroyed. Wow. That's uh-huh. like like everything up to that was like, okay, I don't see where this is going, and then they actually hate him with a pretty terrible thing. It was so bad I actually puked at one point. Wonderful. Mm. Surprised he didn't try to waterboard you, actually. Among over there, but <laughs> oh, I have to deal with that, don't I? How is that going? Um, it's still going. Is, well, wow. I guess that still going. X Waterboarding is demon is work, taking so the there's that. Control. Should probably stop that before it gets too worse. I have a feeling it's going to end badly. In truth, the weaker X gets, the better that my plan will work. Well, X isn't in control right now, last time I checked. Mm hmm. Remember what I tried to do over at your place? So we're trying to. He pulls out a blunderbusser. <laughs> Did we? <laughs> he pulls out a giant needle. We could. The what I'm referring to. Chain to... Him up and I just trank him again? Am I sealing a demon? Again? Yes, in a way. I mean, how do you think I got him out of the Badlands? Fucking hell. We had the tranquilizer. It's more of a similar process yeah. than <laughs> Stan did to Alice. You guys are getting inspiration from, um. Yeah. The devil himself. Um, well, he, to be fair, they, he is a demon. demon. As well. I. <laughs> I mean, it doesn't help that X huh? literally killed somebody that was supposed to be our ally. Two people that were supposed to be our allies. Two yeah. People. Oh, boy. I see. Yeah. One of which was a dragon. Speaking of which, did you hear about the, the sandwich that was named after him? Oh, yeah, I did. There's a sandwich? You heard about yeah. the sandwich? Yes. It's disgusting. That was. <laughs> that sounds like an abomination on the food itself. It is. That was... That, that's what I heard the point of it was, when Sorrow and DK2 made it. Hmm. They, they call it the Stanwich. It is garlic bread with smashed bananas, mayonnaise, and I think possibly peanut butter. That's disgusting. A lot of, uh, Didn't the person named mess. Elvis Presley like bananas on peanut butter sandwiches? Well, yeah, but then you Ooh. throw in the mayonnaise and the garlic, and it's like Apparently an old musician. Way back in the day. Ah, uh, another human and singer. Elvis Presley. I see. Yeah. That sounds good, actually. Peanut butter and bananas. Probably the sweet and salty. Mayonnaise. Oh, and mayonnaise, With no. Mayonnaise and garlic, No, right? not, none of that. No, you know what I had bread. recently? And the peanut butter is only optional, if I remember correctly. I almost killed somebody for this. Somebody served me what they call a breakfast pizza, right? Hey. It had gravy instead of tomato sauce. The fuck? Yeah. Almost killed the person for it. I mean, most of the times when I get a breakfast pizza, it's just cheese. Like, no sauce, no nothing. I mean, I guess. Wow. Well, I make my own pizzas. Like, I don't really trust, like, that store-bought shit. I got a really nice, uh, but stone. I didn't think gravy was supposed to go oven. on pizza, though. I understand why now. Uh, gravy it was disgusting. Uh, Man, and they used to say gravy goes on everything. It's not yeah. true. It's not we had true. Bis- I think the reason why they did it was it was a biscuit crust. I believe the person said. So they tried to do what people, humans eat something called biscuits and gravy, I believe it's called. Now that's amazing. If you haven't had the right biscuits yeah. and gravy. But yeah, buttermilk biscuits, salty, white gravy, some salt, some pepper, sausage. That's the shit. Hmm. 
So, are we well, sealing a demon? Let's go seal a demon. Mm-hmm. All right. You want me I'll to help? Down. I guess I'll do it. I got my magic I sword. Use... How many oh, souls I could use? Also, it's been blessed, oh, so there's that too. No. I could use Kara's yeah. chains. Divine blessing. I have a chain ability. It's called Chains of Perdition. Shut why the fuck not? Oh, okay. Uh, I completely just lost it. I've I can only do that. use it once a day, though. Right now, you're saying. I will save it on my having his swords out. And basically, on top of. Texas sword. A perfect sword for 30 guns. Good. Now, the question is this Is this X or Jebediah? <laughs> Not sure. Is which one is in control? He'd be able to tell. Directly is actually Jebediah. Okay. But yeah, you're, probably, you're probably just like seeing moments. It's like it's like sort of like in and out motion. Mm -hmm. He's been fighting back. Well, who's losing. in control? Uh, Jebediah, but it's him. <sighs> back to trying to regain control. Well, let's go see the demon. I'm, like, I'm kind of new to this. That's oh, pretty my. easy. But I do one of you. The swords start turn and stuff. And since we're trying to wrap around. Oh, I had a billion what is my job been using recently? Well, my job was just to hold them down, but that's already being done. So. Trying to, like, wrap around the grave. I mean, you could just shoot them. You'll start to see, like, the cracks oh, in the reaction, right. so... Hmm. Maybe I should use it now. Five against it, so I'll probably just, like, you're gonna hear a so I don't think they need it. Noise. And I you're gonna think... know exactly what it is. It sounds like a blunderbuss being loaded. Oh, what is it? Is it actually a blunderbuss or is it a needle again? <laughs> it's the needle again! <laughs> yep. <laughs> oh, well, he's, he's fucking too distracted at this point. <laughs> at this point, uh, as, he start, as he starts doing it, it'll probably click. And yep. shoot straight out. Oh, he hasn't shot it yet. He hasn't shot it yet. Oh, he shot it? Okay, wonderful. Fucking thank god. He's aiming it right now. Oh, uh, he's just gonna carry on. Fuck, he's gonna carry on with this shit, man. Doesn't need you right now. He's gonna sneak up a little bit from behind. Oh, fuck. Fuck, he's trying to go. No, why behind? Just shoot him straight in. He's gonna, like, basically go straight into his penis. <laughs> no! <laughs> no! Oh my god. <laughs> Aiming it at you. And he shoots. Hey, get fired! Straight up into the penis! <laughs> <laughs> Told you, it's a blunderbuss! Blunderbuss <laughs> velocity up behind him! You mean the lack of when he's like this? Uh. <laughs> I'm essentially giving a blow drop right now. <laughs> ah, oh stop it! God. It's the same type of trick, Fuzzy. <laughs> and Ma he just, you just hear a clapping of the hands. Like, and my work is done. How do we seal a demon? I don't know. This highly tranquilizer well, dart should work like a couple minutes. Him being asleep is what makes it easier. However, kings and nanooks and bodies. Yes. Do what now? Stand over here. <laughs> Wait, what? Do what now? <laughs> yeah, go over there, please. Eight humans. Uh, it's like a biological thing. He can't eat anything. I else, know a so ghoul. Don't be too hard on him. Freaking, I don't know. His world is types of ghouls. But I don't <laughs> regular ghoul stuff. Uh, so I was saying, uh, you're not gonna learn magic. Yeah. You need to learn. Psychic stuff. I've I I learned to kind of I I think I've reached a thing that I've called enlightenment in my group in my family. What do you mean? You're like I think any. I mean I've been trying, but I'm gonna need more time and uh, everything now from on is just research things that no one in my family has tried. <sighs> It'll take a while. I'll get you a power... I'll, I'll, I'll keep trying it. I'll get you a power stone. They contain psychic abilities from God knows where. Think of it like a scroll for magic users. 
Anyway, instead of a power stone, it's for psychic people. The only psychic people can use. Probably get some magic crystals in Winter Run, actually. It's not the same. Probably not, and it probably cost you an arm and leg. True. I'm telling you, the power stone actually contains an actual psychic ability in it now. You can project. Or use, or I don't know what the fuck this shit is. It could be anything, but, you know, it's, it's weird. Okay. Hmm, I guess we could use some study on it when I obtain it. We could... True. Use it forever. I don't think we'll have enough t time. We're heading out tomorrow. <laughs> yeah. I guess luckily, I've got some. Luckily, I do have a bit of a book to help me learn some new things. In the meantime, while I'm there. <sighs> I just wanted to learn some basic elemental stuff, you know, things that would come naturally to me. Like psychic stuff? Yeah, fair and honestly, I've had, I haven't really been able to learn anything psychic without some guidance. It's generally how it works. It doesn't just pop out of thin air. Magic users learn from other magic users and magic books. It just doesn't just happen unless you're some sort of sorcerer or some sort of innate True. caster like a demon who already has their basic abilities, of course. You're right. I need to start advancing my views, widening my <laughs> mental process. Because that's where I've been stuck in my psychic abilities for 20 years. Well, you're what? An empath, right? Empaths generally. Uh, let me get the tracking. So, empaths generally, you know, emotions and stuff, right? Yeah. That's what I thought. But it. In the last month or so, I've learned it's a bit more than that. Good. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah. Expand. Yeah. I've just... I didn't realize until Elijah was in danger one day. I was. Remember that day we took that chip out of your head? Oh, yeah, that shit. Yeah, you're welcome. Appreciate that. I tried. I remember it. You know what the worst part of this is? What? I'm confused with the person that did that? Yeah. Hmm? I was wondering about that. Being knocked out, I actually now remember what he actually told me to do. It was to kill us, wasn't it? Oh, yeah. It's usually to kill your friends. Gee, thanks, well, guys, on that heads very up. Very gruesomely. Very well, we gruesome. didn't know. I didn't know either until just now. He just kind of... Very it just kind of made sense. Oh, well, knowing your brother, knowing your brother, I'd expect nothing less, actually. Kind of wanted me to put you on meat hooks. Sounds like him. And disembowel you. All right, so the you can spare the gruesome details. Okay, details. okay, you don't, you don't have to tell us anymore. <laughs> yeah, it was bad. Thank you for that information that we definitely needed to know. Well, like I was saying, that was the day I learned that I could take away pain. Brain stuff, yeah. And I realized, brain. and I realized pain isn't an emotion. Spinal cord, nerve receptors, ah. brain stuff, whoa. That's exactly it. Yes. An empath doesn't just do emotions, they control senses. Be very useful. I haven't tried much offensively because it's kind of... Cool, you can make someone go blind, probably. Uh, I, I have dabbled in it. I haven't had much chance to test it. I've had a kind of an adversity to using my psychic powers offensively or at on the very least, else. have like some sort of like cloudy... cloudy you know, I don't yeah, know. Fake images, fake sounds, smells. Yep. Generally, I... Well, if it makes you feel any better, the war crimes don't really exist in my world, so... Oh, boy. Go no, on don't out. worry. I wasn't, uh... Nah, it was just something in my past. That makes you but, um... worry about certain things that you would... No, 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 no. It doesn't really exist. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, no, I just... There was something in my past kind of holding me back, but Lucian helped me out with it. That's good. Better him doing it than me. Well, it... 
Yeah, I don't think you could have anyway. Well, I would just say my methods of doing stuff like that aren't technically looked greatly upon in this world. So I've heard. So I've heard. You don't have to. You could stop there. I am going to stop there. Oh, yeah, we. For ages. There was something in my memories. Yeah. That I'd forgotten. I don't want ages on my ass. Then they don't get them I on your ass. Most people. Sheesh. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Only easiest way to do that is just like try to piss one of us off, you know. I mean, really, I mean, it shouldn't it, exactly why I don't piss you off or try not to. I wonder how the, how's the demon uh, thing going. <laughs> oh, I think we did it. We gotta do it. He walked off, but he is in control of himself. Uh, good job, team. Good job. Why is he here? Why is he here? I'm most confused in and out. I can't be here. Why is Take... Sam here? Oh no. What the hell? Oh, uh, he's annoying. That's Sam. Oh no. Mm -hmm. Oh, why? Where is Sam? Uh, oh well, he's gone. Who cares? Sounds nasty there. I'm gonna, I'm gonna start perching up here. Oh wow! Why is it coming up? Huh? Yeah, thanks for giving me the crazy sparring partner. <laughs> Like I said, it was his plan in the first place to spar with you. Mm. How'd yours go? Uh, it tried to kill me throughout the entire fight, so... Uh... Yeah, that type of training's not fun. Mm. Uh, that was like a $30 level of training you went through. Wait, were you trying to kill me the whole time? At least maim enough. Oh my god. Cool, uh... Did you like that little trick with your weapons, though, that I tried? Yeah. That was not fun. So, the scythe one worked better than the gun one. <laughs> cool. Part two of training. Actual tactics. Yay. Right, we should talk. <sighs> yeah. Very strange.